Hi, this time I'll talk about some adverbs which are often used in storytelling to emphasize that something interesting is about to happen. Which of these adverbs are positive, which are negative, and which ones are neutral? Coincidentally, fortunately, luckily, miraculously, sadly, strangely, suddenly, surprisingly, unexpectedly, unfortunately. Now that you have listened and decided which ones were positive, negative, and neutral, we want you to complete the following statements with those adverbs so you can come up with creative sentences. Hello, this time we want you to listen to the following conversation. The idea is for you to understand what's going on and also to practice it with a friend or a relative. Once you do that, we want you to play the second part of the conversation and get ready to answer the question I have for you. What have you been doing? Part A. Listen and practice. Hey, Gina. I haven't... Hello, hello, Wendy. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. How do you feel today? Uh, today, very nice. I finished to work around 4 p.m. Really? And what do you do? In my job. That is correct. Uh, and I am an agent in Telus for oh. account in Spanish. Oh, that's nice. So it's like a call center. Call center, yes. In what area? Is customer service. And how long have you been working in the customer service area? Um, 6 a.m. from 4 p.m. Oh, wow. And are you working on site or from home? In on site. On site. Yes. And what do you prefer, from home or on site? In on site. Why? Because I, I understand more the account. Oh, okay, okay. All right. Well, welcome back. I hope that you had an awesome weekend. How was your weekend? My weekend. How I... was your weekend? Hello, Eric. Good evening. With my children, I was to visit the college because they celebrated, I don't know how you say, how do you say, intramuros? <laughs> field day, field, field day. day. Intramuros, we say field day. Field day day f-i-e-l-d field day like that field day excellent excellent and what sports did your children play during their field day yeah football soccer because I, I have two children soccer uh-huh <laughs> okay Uh, okay, so you have two children and both of them play soccer. Play, play soccer is correct. That's awesome. That's awesome. Thank you, Wendy, <laughs> so much for sharing your experience this weekend. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, hello, Eric Ramirez. How are you? Hello, teacher. Uh, how, very good. Teacher. How do you feel today? And I feel good. <laughs> how was your weekend? I I was play soccer. I was play. I was visiting my my mother really where does your mother live sorry teacher where does your mother live uh, my mother my mother uh, lives in yeah country, no, country rosario de mora Ah, uh, the countryside. Countryside. The countryside. The countryside. Okay, okay. And what do you normally do when you go to the countryside? Uh, sorry, teacher. I, I don't understand. Ah, I repeat. What do you normally do when you go to the countryside? Um, normally, only only my uh, area. How se dice? Canton or no sé. Canton village. 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 Um, this is my village. Uh, I say I I'm going to all weekend. Ah, I you can say I go every weekend. I, I go every I go every weekend i go every weekend uh, play soccer in i my go village. every weekend to play soccer to play. in my village awesome awesome thank you eric for your participation. Thank you All right, guys, let's go ahead and move forward. What we're going to do at this moment is we're going to continue working from the activities that we have set on the platform. So for today's class, I would like for us to move forward. We're going to be working from section 2.6 conversation what have you been doing? What have you been doing? Everybody, please listen and repeat. What have you been doing? What have you been doing? Everybody, listen and repeat. What have you, what have have you, you been, been doing? doing? One more time. One more time. What have you been doing? What, what have, have you, you been, been doing? doing? Okay. Now, at this moment, we're going to watch the video about using what have you been doing. Please listen and take notes in your notebook. Listen and take notes in your notebook. Hello. Can everybody Today hear? I want you to listen to the following conversation. Can we everybody hear? For you to understand what's going on and also to yes. practice it with a friend. Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay. To do that, we want you to play the second part of the conversation and get ready to answer the question I have for you. What have you been doing? Part A. 
Listen and practice. Hey, Gina. I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. How come? I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I've only been spending money. I'm pursuing a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. What has happened to Pete and Gina since they last saw each other? Please write your answer on our discussion box. Part B. Listen to two other people at the party. What has happened since they last saw each other? Bob, I finally how's been it spending going? Pretty good, thanks. I haven't seen you for a while. What have you been up to? Well, I've been looking I for a house to buy. I finally found doing. one last month. That's terrific. Yeah, I'm really tired of renting. So what have you been doing lately? Well, I just got back from a vacation in Italy. Italy? Where in Italy? Mostly in the north, around Milan. I have a cousin there. I see. Did you have a good time? Yeah, it was great. In fact, I just got engaged to a guy I met there. You're kidding. Well, that must have been some vacation. All right. Now I would like for you to tell me what vocabulary from this conversation you don't understand. What vocabulary from this section you don't understand? No questions at this moment? Teacher. Where in the phrase, how come, what is, what is uh, the meaning? How come is another way to ask why, why? Mm -hmm. It is in, in informal ways. That is correct. It is an informal way to ask why. Okay, thank you, teacher. Thank you. All right, now what we are going to do at this moment is practice, listen, and repeat. Hey, Gina. Hey, Gina. I haven't seen you in ages. I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been up to? What, sorry, what have you been doing lately? 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 One more time, one more time. What have you been doing lately? I had to be what doing have you been doing, doing lately? lately? Nothing exciting. Nothing exciting. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. How come? How come? I'm saving up my money for a trip to Morocco. I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. I'm saving up my money for a trip to Morocco. I'm saving up my money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Yeah, it is. What about you? Yeah, it is. What about you? Yes. 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 What about you? Well, I've only been spending money. 
I'm pursuing a full-time modeling career. I'm pursuing a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? 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 Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any good work. Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. Since I graduated, I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. Excellent. Excellent. All right. At this moment, does anybody have any questions related to the pronunciation or the meaning of these words? Okay. Now, what we're going to do is work in pairs, and then you're going to present the conversation to the class. You are going to practice in pairs, and then you are going to present the conversation to the class in pairs. At this moment, you are going to practice the pronunciation in pairs, and then you are going to present the conversation as a class. You can share your screen. You can share your screen. Share your screen. You can share your screen. You can share your screen. You can share your screen. Is section three point. Have you been doing lately? You can share your screen. You can share your screen. Okay. Okay. You can share your screen. You can share your screen. This moment, I modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. I need job soon. I'm almost out of money. No sé si la repetimos y luego cambiamos el papel. Sí. sí. Okay. Um, hey Gina, I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. I have been working to job for the last six months. How come? I saving good money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is what I, about you. Well, I've only been spending money. I am pursuing a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. I need job soon. I am al I am almost out of money. Okay. Okay. Ahora que ves. Entonces, okay, empiezo yo. Hi, mm -hmm. Gina. I haven't seen you in A's. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. 
How come? I am saving of money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I only been, I bring money in pursuit a full-time modeling for career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been working any work. I need a job soon. I am most out of money. Okay, practicamos otra vez. <coughs> okay, Perfect. eso y otra vez. Uh -huh. Hey, Gina, I haven't seen you in age. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. I've been working two jobs for the last six months. <coughs> How come? I'm saving up. I'm, I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that is exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I only been spending money in pursuing a full time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Science. I graduated, but I haven't been going anywhere. I need that job soon. I am most out of money. Okay. Excellent. <clears throat> no sé si quiere que practiquemos otra vez más. Sí. ¿Cuál va a ser usted? Si quiere empezar, ajá, empieza usted y sigo yo. Va. Hey Gina, I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? All right, all right. Is everybody finished? Yes, yes teacher. Finish. All right, let's change partners. All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen. Is everybody finished? I said, I said, is everybody finished? Are you finished? Yes, finished. Okay, now that everybody is finished at this moment, does anybody have any questions about the pronunciation or the meaning of these words, questions at this moment. Okay, now. What the mean teacher? Yes. Pursuing. Pursuing is like, pursuing. that's right. Pursuing means that you are continuously a, uh, chasing something that you want. For example, for example, uh, have you ever seen the movie by Will Smith in pursuit of happiness? Have you ever watched that movie? in pursuit of happiness? Yes. Okay. So in that movie, what is he trying to do? He is trying to obtain something. What is that something? Happiness. And how is he going to obtain that 
happiness, getting a job, trading yes. in yes. Golden Sachs, making millions. That's going to make him happy. Is having mm -hmm. a million going to make me happy? Yes, it's going to make me happy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank that, you. Excellent. Now, what we are going to do is we are going to change partners. Change partners. Practice the conversation at least three times. Eric, Wendy, let's go. Wendy, let's go. Wendy, Wendy, where are you? You can share your screen. You can share your screen. Okay, practice. I, I'm Gina and you, Pete. Okay. I'm doing. You can share your screen. Yes, teacher. All right. I've been working. Job for the last six months. How come? I'm sorry, and I'm only been spending money. I'm pursuing a full time modeling career. Oh, really? How long have you been modeling? Uh. Hello. Panta, what have you been doing? Panta, la the question, the pit. Ah, que ya lo había dicho. Yo soy pit. Hey, Gina, I haven't seen, I haven't seen you in ages. Uh -huh. Next, next. But how, but have you been doing it literally? No, nothing exciting. I've be, been working job for the last six months. How come? I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Yeah. It, what about you? Well, I only been spending money. I purchased a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Seems I gra graduate, but I haven't been getting any job, any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. Okay. Yes. Hey, Gina, I haven't seen you in age. What have you been doing lately? Nothing excited. I've been working two jobs for the last, last six months. How come? I'm saving, I saving up money for a trip to Marruecos. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, yes, it is. What about you? Well, I've only been spending money in pursuing a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I'm almost out of money. Okay. Pronunciation is lately or late. 
Uh, what, excuse me? It, it, what have you been doing lately? Ah, es, um, I think it's later, 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 lately, lately, lately. Uh -huh, Ajá, porque solo sin la L y la Y sería late. Uh -huh. sería lately. Lately, ajá. Uh -huh. uh, thank you. I think. El, eh, this is a bit person. I'm person. 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 What meaning person? Como esforzándose. Ah. Thanks. Thank you, Amanda. Okay. Hey, how you doing, Amanda? Hey, what's going on, Amanda? Going on. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes, teacher, I'm ready. All right, let me have Amanda and Eric. Eric, you are Pete. Amanda, you are Gina. Action. I'm sorry, teacher, but I don't, I don't have the screen because I, I can't find it in the platform. All right, can you see it on my screen? Uh, uh, yeah, yes, I did, okay. Yeah. Uh, hey, Gina, I haven't, I haven't seen you in ages. Uh, what have you been doing lately? 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 Nothing exciting. I've been working to job for the last six months. How come? I'm saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I've only been spending money. i pursuing a full-time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I gra I graduate, but but I haven't been getting any work. I need a job soon. I almost have of money. Excellent work. Good Thank job. You. Thank you, teach. All right, Amanda, select somebody. Eric, select somebody. Okay, uh, Lisette Castillo. Lisette Castillo, you are. Gina. Kevin. Who? Kevin Antonio. Kevin Antonio, you are Pete. Action. Action. I know see that picture. Action. Okay. Hey Gina, I haven't seen you in age. What haven't you been doing? Ages, 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 plural, ages. It's like when okay. I say a long time. Uh, hey Gina, I haven't seen you in ages. What have you been doing lately? Nothing exciting. I've been working to job for the last six months. How come? I saving up money for a trip to Morocco. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, it is. What about you? Well, I only been spending money. I am posting a full time modeling career. Really? How long have you been modeling? Since I graduated, but I haven't been getting any work. I knew I joined soon. I am almost out of money. 
All right. Excellent work. Excellent work. All right, guys. Now, what we are going to do is continue to the next section. For this activity, we are going to be looking at another video referring to the present continuous. Conversation. Everybody here? Can, examples of Can everybody hear? Yes, here. Okay. Now, we want you to stay for the explanation of the structure and use of the present perfect continuous. Present perfect continuous. Use the present perfect continuous for actions that start in the past and continue into the present. What have you been doing lately? I've been working two jobs for the last six months. How long have you been modeling? I've been modeling since I graduated. Have you been saving money? No, I haven't been saving any money. I've been spending it. Moving on. Present perfect continuous is a tense used for. A continuous or repeated activity that began in the past and continues into the present. It emphasizes the activity itself and its duration. Let's look at these examples. Jack has been waiting for over an hour. I've been studying since three o'clock. How long have you been studying French? And last but not least, we'll go over the structure of these tense. For affirmative, this is what we use. I, we, you, they, plus have been, plus verb, plus ing. He, she, it, plus has been, plus verb, plus ing. When in negative, we need to add the word not between have or has and been. And as always, in questions, the helping verb or the auxiliary goes at the beginning, followed by the subject, like this. Have plus subject plus been plus verb plus ing plus complement. Have you been saving money? Can we now work on the following exercises? How long have you been learning English? Why are you tired? What have you been doing? What have you been eating? Okay, at this moment, does anybody have any questions related to this section right here? Questions? Not teacher. All right, so what you're going to do is you are going to answer the questions using the present perfect continuous you doing? and you are going to write them over here in the discussion forum in pairs. You will have five minutes. You will work with the same partner. Ready? Let's go. Hello, Eric. You can share your screen. Eric, will you share, please? One moment. Never. You're going to answer the questions in the discussion forum. Okay. Uh, I. I have been learning English. One 
in my case, I studying with, with uh, like here. Why are you tired? What have you been doing? I have you I have been doing work working. I have been working. Hasta ahí va. Yes, every day. I have been eating pupusas. Y no es mentira. <laughs> Uh, six pieces for the in the dinner. dinner. Uh, no, only one pupusas. Kevin, hay que ponerlo en, la, en el foro. ¿Tú? Hay que colocarlo en el foro. Y en el comentario, ¿verdad? ¿Qué sección es? ¿La dos? Dos tipos siete creo que es, dos puntos siete. Veamos. The present continuous Eva dos punto ocho. Esa es. In the title, uh, read a question or no? Mm, yo le puse el present con present perfect continuo. Mm. Lo que dice arriba del. Science Ferrari Two, two, I, In my case, I have been learning English since Ferrari. Le voy a copiar. <laughs> I have learning English, ¿verdad? I have been. I have been learning English. Science, ¿qué significa de este? English. Science. Que de ahí el mes que usted comenzó. Science. Fe, uh, February. 
February. February. Mhm. Pero sí. No, si quiere pongamos el año. No. No, solo eso. <laughs> el dos. La, el dos. Sería. Why are you tired? Mm -hmm. What have you okay. been doing? I have been working in my case. Mm -hmm. I um, in your case, I, I don't know. I don't. Mm. What are you tired? Yes, for my job. I was finished around 5 p.m. 5 p.m. Why? Mm -hmm. And I for two hours in the bus in a bus in the bus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I have we work because. I have been working because I have been working. Because sería, ¿verdad? Sí. Because I have, have been working. Mm -hmm. Working. What have you been airing? I have been. I have been. ¿Cuál estamos contestando ahorita? La última. What, la tercera. What, what have you been eating? Mm -hmm, yes. ¿Qué he comido? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué he estado comiendo? ¿Qué he estado comiendo? Ah. Sería, I have been, I have been eating. Uh -huh. um, mm. Rice, beans. Rice. In my case, rice, beans. In my case, pasta. <laughs> mm, what? Yes. For today. Chicken. And chicken. Pupusas. In my uh, case. In, in my case. In my case. Yeah, I'm in my case too. I have been chicken pupusas. Panes rellenos en ahora, pero no sé cómo usted dice. ¿El qué? Panes rellenos. No, no sé cómo se dice. Bread with chicken. <risa> <risa> pane, pane con pollo. Mm -hmm. Bread okay. with chicken. Yes. <risa> and so, and so, with so. Uh -huh. Hey, what's going on, Kevin? Hey, Kevin, what's going on, Kevin? Sorry, teacher. Hey, how you doing? Is your partner Lisette Castillo? Yes. All right. Can you give me your examples, please? Can you give me your answers to the question, Kevin? How long have you been learning English? I uh, have uh, about uh, one year studying English. All right, so you could say, I have been learning English for one year. Excellent. The next question, Angelica, 
Why are you tired? What have you been doing? I'm tired because I work and I I've been have been I'm working sorry. like that. Uh, in the first one, I write, I'm tired because I work. And the second one, I writing, I've been writing reports. Oh, okay. That's awesome. You can say, I have been writing reports for eight hours. Excellent. Angelica, continue. Monica, what have you been eating? Monica Escobar, can you hear me? All right. Marlon Barrientos, are you there? Yes. Awesome. What have you been eating? I have been eating pupusas, rice, chicken. Chicken. Excellent. Perfect. Excellent work. Everybody listen and repeat. I have been learning English for one year. 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 I have been working for eight hours. I have been working for eight hours. Excellent. I have been writing reports for eight hours. I have been writing reports for eight hours. I have been eating pupusas, rice, and chicken for three days. I have been, I have been, I have been eating pupusas, rice, rice, and chicken, and chicken for, three days. for three days. Awesome. Awesome. Any questions referring to this activity? No questions. Okay, let's go ahead and move forward to the knowledge check. Now, in this section, this is section 2.9, 2.9. In this section, you are going to complete the conversations with the present perfect continuous. For most of the exercises, you need to select two choices except for the first letter. Now, whenever you are using the present perfect continuous, you usually have the subject, I, have the auxiliary, been is the be verb, and then the verb in the continuous tense. I have been learning for one year. Or you could say, I have been learning since 2021. Both express the same idea. Please work in pairs and then we will check together. I'm going to change the groups. Remember to share your screen. Okay. 
complete the conversation with the present perfect continuous for most of the exercise. You need to select the choice except for the first letter B. Ah, se seleccionan dos. Sí. Ah, uh, uh, and letter B. But uh, in this case, select one choice. Okay, in letter A, what have you been doing lately? What have you been doing lately? Lately. Mm -hmm. B, letter B, letter B. Well, I have been spending my free time at the beach. Or oh, beach. Beach. Mm -hmm. Second letter A. Um, question. Question. Have and the first have you been working part time this year? Yes. And letter B. Letter B. I. Mm, I have. I have. I, and I have been my making drinks at coffee time for the past few months. Yes. Yes, I have. I have been making drinks at the coffee time for the past few months. Mm -hmm. Okay. Option B, letter A. How have how have you all right guys, time's up, time's up. Please continue working on the platform and we will see you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good night. All right, see you tomorrow. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good see you tomorrow.